Hi guys, um, my computer's being stupid, and I have two reviews that you probably will never see ever because my computer does not want to upload them to the internet, and they are reviews for The Born Legacy and Abraham Lincoln Vampire Hunter, and I just decided what the fuck and just n I'm not gonna post them. So I, I, I'm hoping this gets on there. That'd be nice. Oh, I got my hair cut. I guess that's obvious. Um, but you haven't seen me in a while, so. But, uh, this is a review for Resident Evil Retribution. Resident e Evil Retribution is basically a video game, uh, that got transferred into a movie, and I don't know... The, the plot is thin. So, Alice has, um, like, if you've seen the other ones, clones and stuff. Storyline gets vague after a while, and it doesn't really matter. Um, so basically she gets captured after the end of the fourth one, and they torture her, and then she gets, uh taken out. She gets um, rescued by Ada Wong and Leon Kennedy, who are from the video games, and they have to go through this underground, the underground umbrella uh, simulated stuff, simulated towns, which they use to make, to see how the virus works. Um, they have to get through three of these different towns, and then escape to the surface, and all around escape. Basically, that's the plot. That's all you're gonna get, because you don't need to plot with these movies, honestly. You really don't. Um, I really, really, really liked this movie. I really like the Resident Evil series in general. They're not the greatest movies ever made, but as far as action movies go, they're amazing. The stunt work is something to marvel at, really. I mean, that's part of the reason I go to it. I might go see this one again, and see it again in 3D as well, because I saw it in 3D the first time. I saw it yesterday afternoon, and I was thoroughly impressed with everything in it. I actually saw this panel at Comic-Con this year, I got into this one, and I don't know how, but it was awesome. All the cast and crew are amazing. Um, Mila Jovovich is freaking fantastic, and I don't know. If they keep making Resident Evil movies that are just as good as this one, I will keep seeing them because they're so much fun. Uh, Michelle Rodriguez came back. It was great. Um, pretty much this entire movie was just a blast from the beginning to the end. Non-stop action. Guns, zombies, you know... Great stunt work, like I said. The special effects were pretty damn good. And the 3D was spectacular. Um, I really, really like it. And it's probably an unpopular opinion. I know a lot of people love them because of how bad they are. But honestly, I mean, they are cheesy. But hey, they're kind of, they're not as dead serious as Underworld. Like, I watched the last, the newest Underworld, and that was really serious and really stupid. Like, it was extremely cheesy. Resident Evil, I feel, is tongue-in-cheek. And they, you can tell the cast and crew have a blast filming the movie. Um, you can tell they really love it because it shows on screen how much fun they're really having. It was a fun movie to see and I definitely will pick it up when it comes out. And um, I thoroughly enjoyed it and I highly recommend it to fans of the series or just if you want a good action movie or a pretty fun zombie movie even. Um, hot girls, guns, and you know, like I said 7,000 times and I'll say it even more, the stunt work which is what I would totally, you know, applaud them completely on their stunt work. So go see Resident Evil Retribution. I honestly think it's worth it. It's a blast. They're cheesy, but they're so much fun, and they're great popcorn movies. And I kind of hope they keep making them, because I really do enjoy the series. Um, there's no plot, like I said earlier, but that doesn't really matter, because you don't need a plot, really. I mean, honestly. Not with these type of movies. They don't need them. So Resident Evil Ret Retribution gets a uh, 4 out of 5 or an 8 out of 10. I, I thoroughly enjoyed it and it's if you take it for what it is and don't take it seriously you'll have a lot of fun with it I think. Um, go in expecting a light popcorn movie full of action and you know great 3D and that's what you get. Don't go in expecting a masterpiece because it's not. So hopefully this uploads for you guys. I'm gonna try and work on that and um, see you for perks of being a wallflower, I guess, unless my town gets the master, and then you'll get a review for that. So thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe. Uh, comment below if you want me to review a certain movie. Um, I'll try and I'll watch it for you, and you get a shout out. And um, yeah, that's about it. Bye.